What is up, Westridge kids? It's Cowboy Day. We're gonna teach you how to be an authentic cowboy. Now, the first thing to being a cowboy is you gotta be in a great big pastures farm so we didn't have one so we put this green screen up and I put on the best background I could find. Hey, hey, hey we literally drove like two hours. We're, we're in a pasture. This is an actual authentic farm. Oh, well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, real live animals. Now as you can see we look like cowboys and we're what? Mike, Michael, Michael. Where's? I, maybe he's still putting on his Hi. authentic cowboy yeah. costume. Michael. Michael? Yeah. What is Michael? Michael, oh, over. oh my goodness! Oh, no. oh I, my goodness! I don't. Michael, what what are you wearing? Michael, hey, my horse broke down. What what is that? Cowboy. No, no, we said authentic. Remember, cow we said we we're going to Boots Leather and More to pick out our outfits. We're training them to be cowboys. Cowboy. What cowboy Hello, are you? this is the genuine, real cowboy. Um, that is Woody from Toy Story, Michael. No. Yeah. 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 Is it? He's a sh literally a sheriff. You literally have a tag that says Toy Story from yeah. Disney. Do you have a snake in your boot? No, but I got dog poop on my shoe. Well, then that's, that's step that's one to be a cowboy. It. Well, guys, today we're going to be going through different things on how to be a cowboy. So, you guys ready? Let's get started. Yeah! All right, so uh, one of the things cowboys do, we lasso stuff. Now, put on your listening ears. So you've got to undo your belt, take your rope out, redo your belt while you hold the rope between your legs, keep your hat on your head, and then redo, grab your lasso like this. Now, this should all be done a half a millisecond. See, just like how I did it. You got to catch your prey quickly. All right, Hayden, are you ready to I'm show ready. them how to do it? So first things first, you got to get your loop. You got a loop. You're gonna hold it by the top here. Keep this by your waist. And it's a special loop, it's right? It's a special loop. You're gonna need something called uh, <laughs> zip ties. Zip, zip ties. ties. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Zip ties to close it up. So yeah, yeah. Once you hold it by the zip tie knot, you're We're gonna, gonna start. Treat, this with donkey spinning. is your 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 place to get. get if you move out. your hips no, with no, the not rope, yet. not yet. It not yet, creates like stronger, it. stronger force. Yeah, more, and then, more like a whip. Once you're ready to fire, hey, hey, and just like that, I got it. Hayden, you. Wow! No, no, Hayden, you, you, threw, the, the you threw the whole rope. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Look at that, that. That's one approach. And I caught the donkey. <laughs> the donkey ran off so, in fear because pretty, the rope was attached to him. Pretty easy to catch. Now you can even do the same thing to people. Hold on now. Whoa, it, hold on. Going, hold on. Hold on. Oh. And, and then just, I just caught Pastor Brent. That just stings. Yeah. Ow. I stun you. And okay. I'm ready to catch All right, you. Right, now. I caught you. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. He's got my ankle. I caught All right. Now I'll give it a shot. All right. Pass the brand, pass the brand, pass the brand. All right, all right. Pass All right. Here's how it works. Hold on, hold on, Here. cowboy. Hold Here's on. Here's how cowboy. it works. Cowboy, oh. you got no, you got no loop. That's, oh. ju that's just a string. Okay, okay. That's okay. just, okay. It's okay. just some, some yarn right there. All right, hold on, <laughs> hold on. I'll, I'll get it all ready. You get the hoop. I've been tying my shoes for years. Once you hoop it, then you can just. Oh, okay, okay. And then okay. you can catch your prey. You catch it. You got it. All right, yes. I've got my hoop. All right, all right. <laughs> Oh, come on. Ah, right. 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 Here go. Here go. Here go. Here Here we go. Ah, ah, stop, stop ah, drop and roll. Okay, stop okay. drop and roll, baby. Okay, okay. Whoa. Go. Whoa. I don't know what to actually do here now. This, this is, oh, oh. This is horrible. Oh, no. you got him. Oh, that's you got not him. how it works. That just gives you Whoa, rope my head. burn. My head. I have rope burn on my neck now. And you catch him. And then you hug him. Oh, and like you whip him. <laughs> Now a, a good cowboy comes equipped with what all cows love. Oh. Cheez Its. And Let's see if they work. Animal crackers. Animals for animals. For some reason the big and one. Rounds. The big one with giant antlers does not like us. Hey. Oh. Yeah. Try yeah. his apple. He's offering. Eat Cheez Its. Oh. Yeah. Oh. oh he's gonna choke on us. He's gonna die. Gonna kill our Don't cow. Wallow. If you're familiar with a reindeer, this is a similar species, but it's called a cow deer. All right, so the antlers keep the predators at bay. Oh, no. Hey, 
cow. We're starting to notice the cows enjoy non-processed foods. That's why how they keep their slender figure. Should we hang tassels on his horns? Yep. I'm going to get on him like a horse, hold on to the horns, and ride him around the pasture. Yes. Yeah. Oh, oh, yes. He only wants some of the apple because he's watching his figure. That means give me cheese. Oh, they're all coming. Give me cheese. Oh, no. Oh, my God. That it's horse. A battle. They're, it's they're a battle. talking. That's right, Sir Lancelot. I will now get on you and ride you. Stay here as I get and pretend that you are a horse. Uh, I am now riding the horse. Do you see that? The, I am now riding the horse. The horse left. The horse left at a rapid, quick pace. Being a cowboy makes you hungry. Mmm. What? You want some too? Okay, cow. That is not good. Uh, hey, is he coming to you? So we're we're now gonna give them these gentle, gentle creatures some carrots. Watch your step. Because we know they want them. Here, give them right. some carrots. Hey guys, go on my head! We have carrots! So this is the sneak up approach. Backs to the animal. They think we're walking away from them, but we're really walking towards them. And now we're gonna run at them in three, two, one. Yell the, yell, yell, we have carrots, then they'll know. We have carrots! Now they know. Yeah, we want to go hang out with the animals. We'll, uh, we'll meet you guys over there. Dang! Man, I stepped in, <laughs> I stepped in poopy. We, uh, drove all the way over here to hang out with animals. Yeah. Now we gotta go into a valley. We're starting to realize, and I don't, I don't think these animals like Pixar characters. I don't think this is a, Look at that. I'm sure that's what it is. Yeah. This is it, guys. This is it. About to begin. All right, here we go. I'm ready. <laughs> Not easy being a cowboy, baby. Man. Hate it, hate it. Don't move. There is a horse fly on your back. There's a. You mean swatted away? No, no, no. I got it. I got there's it. There's a horse on my back. A horse fly. fly. It's a very, very large. Oh, my head. And this is what they do. I'm nervous. <laughs> Help. Was that was that helpful? What is wrong with you? They are not interested in any of those cameras. I'm being super here. generous feeding these things. We're gonna run out of food and nobody's had a morsel. Hey, it's the furry cow feeds a lot. Garrett! That's where we go in right there. So as cowboys, we uh we know that we have to be around some wild animals. Some scary animals. So we found Terrifying. some wolves. Yep, here, I'll, I'll grab one. I'll right grab quick. one too. Everybody grab a wolf. Oh, grab right, a right. wolf. Oh, got one. look at right. these wolves. Now, These are ferocious Not species. anybody. Look at the face of a, of a, almost like a dragon. Like That's he's right. ready to rip you to death. But we know how to handle them. That's why, right? Yes. Right. Okay, this okay. Is how you I think he almost ate my brains out. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, they're scary. They're okay. scary. Oh, yeah. he's careful. He's careful. getting me. Careful. Ah! Careful. Ah! Hey, 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 hey. Ah! He's just licking your face. Okay. Oh. Okay, well, wolves, we're going to let you go so you can attack things go out in the wild. Yes. Protect the land. Protect us. Land. Remember? Land. land. Go protect us. Okay. So, uh, we we're looking around, plotting out the land, and we found some some ginormous goats. Oh man, yeah. the biggest I've seen. They were huge. So you, you, you Brand, should go get them. We need you to go in and get a goat. The Me biggest, the biggest, goat you can find. meanest looking goat yes. you can find. Wrangle that goat. I gotta go in there by myself. Yes. All by yourself. You got it. Good luck, we'll cowboy up. Good luck. All right, my lucky and if you need us, we'll be way over here. Oh, okay. Move, move, wolves. Okay. All right. If you need me. Oh. Oh, it's gold! I got it! I got it! I got it! I found it! I found it! What? What? That's not a very big goat. That's not a big goat. It's the biggest... It's the only one that didn't buck me with his horns. Okay, he's calling his mom. What? 
Say, say something say else. Something. Ah! Say, say it. Ah! Oh! Oh! This is a. Uh... Hello. Okay. Nice you want you. this? <laughs> yes. Okay. Pretty sure that. I think it wants it back. You can't be the goat, the goat. Okay. I will put you back in your pen, but no more attacking like you did earlier. Okay? No, no, no. Oh, don't. God, only I can touch them. Okay. Oh, yeah. He's a let's goat go, whisperer. Let's go inside, everyone. Come on, back this yeah. way. Michael. Uh, what are we... Michael, what are you doing? Ah, these animals. What? Do they, they love you? I, th I think this is a, an attack I mode. I think the wolves are in attack mode. They're attacking There's Michael. There's only one thing no. to do. Don't Run. Don't leave me. Run. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Let's go. Ride it, ride it. Ride it. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Look at this. Look at this. Fresh droppings. Oh, that's gross. Right out of a donkey. That's gross. What do I get? What are we trying to get Michael to eat it? He wouldn't eat it. I think we can convince it's him. It's Michael. Okay. Look at him. Look at him. He thinks he looks cool right now. <laughs> what is he doing? Uh, Michael. Check, check this out. Come here. Michael, come here. Look, look, look. It's a. Uh, Hey, we, yeah, we got some brownies. They just dropped some brownies off we, for we, us. We found a, a, a field patty. A field patty. Field, yeah, a field patty. A yeah, field patty. Quick, field patties. They're, quick. They're really good. Come here. Come here. Before it's gone, come here. What's a field patty? A field patty. It's what they, uh, sometimes the people leave out here for people like us to find and eat. Yeah, come here. Come oh, really? on. Yeah, yeah. If they're so good, we, oh man, I'm What's full. I just. Like? Yeah, here, look, we, we just ate so much, there's all this left. So full. You guys had some? Is it good? Yeah, 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 yeah man, yeah, just yeah. try it, really? just so you know. Just yeah. so you know. Hmm. What is it, Michael? Is it a field patty? Yeah, it's a field patty. Yeah, yeah. We gotta, we gotta go over here while you uh, yeah. finish that. Here's yeah. some more if you want it. Wait a minute. Guys, this is poop! This ain't a field bag! Golly! Cannot believe it made me eat the poop! Yeah. I think I brought my trusty Pepto Bismol. Uh, more than that. Now I gotta go pee. Oh man. Well guys, I'm back from the ranch. I'll take this stuff off. Just being a cowboy reminded me of something. Whew. Good thing I have a shirt on underneath this shirt because that would be embarrassing. You know what I'm saying? Be like, where are you going to the swimming pool, Brent? <laughs> no, I've got a little Bible story for you. And being a cowboy reminded me of it. Well, hopefully you're learning how to be a cowboy because we're sort of experts. We read a book or two watched a YouTube video or two and now we think we're cowboy experts and so I don't maybe comment below how you think we're doing mm -hmm. okay but I decided today was a perfect time in the middle of this series that we're doing called legacy to do four fun facts four fantastic fun facts it's a lot of those words facts fun facts. okay so I tried to find some fun facts or for cowboys and for regular people like you and me before you become an expert cowboy. All right, so uh, fun fact number one. You cannot hum while holding your nose. A cowboy can't do it, nor can regular people do it. So we will try. I will hum happy trails. Oh, it blows out your eardrums. Whew, give it a shot. Try it. I'm waiting. Fun fact number two. One lightning bolt 
pfft, enough electricity to fry up, cook up 100,000 pieces of bread. That's right, 100,000 pieces of toast, just like that, from one lightning bolt. Now, that's a fun fact, because cowboys, I'm sure they love toast. I don't know, I, I love toast, so maybe cowboys do. And I'm a cowboy, so yes. All right, are you ready for fun fact number three? You can hear a blue whale's heartbeat from over two miles away. Well, let's see if we can hear one. Listen. Boo! <laughs> Just kidding. I, I didn't hear one. I'm assuming there is no blue whales around here. But you know, a cowboy needs to know if there's a blue whale getting in the way of his stampeding cows as he takes them from place to place. Because the last thing you want is, is a, a whale, you know, hurting your cow. So, keep an eye on that. All right, fun fact number four. Ooh, the fourth fun fact for fun facts today is fun fact number four. Cowboys were known to wear the same clothes for weeks and weeks and weeks. I know, what? And I know some of you kids, families, maybe you guys do too. I don't know, I'm not to judge. I can't smell you, this is not smell-o-vision, all right? This is a YouTube video, me and you. So, I mean, cowboys, same clothes, it made sense. I had to take my cowboy clothes off because uh, they were already starting to have a bit of an odor. Woo! Chickens, smells like chickens. And not the kind you eat at a restaurant, all right? Now listen, um, something else that I've discovered, a bonus fun fact, four fun facts, plus one, is this. Cowboys can receive the Holy Spirit and become Christians. Actually, everyone can. Ooh, there's a good story about how everyone can receive the Holy Spirit. It comes from the book of Acts chapter two. Listen to this. I got it here, okay. Book of Acts chapter two. This is called the day of Pentecost. And you're like, Pastor Brent, that's a really big word. I, I know, but check this out. <clears throat> it says on the day of Pentecost, there was this sound like the blowing of a violent wind and it came from heaven. Now remember, Jesus has already left the earth and now he says there's a helper coming. This is it. The Holy Spirit is about to enter the scene. And right at this time, suddenly this sound, like a blowing of violent wind, came from heaven. Verse 3 says, They saw what seemed like tongues of fire that separated and came to rest on each of them, on each of the disciples. All of a sudden, they were filled with the Holy Spirit. And they began to speak in other tongues and in other languages. Whoa, so this is the first time the disciples had the Holy Spirit. What Jesus promised, remember, what he promises always comes true. But Jesus promised the Holy Spirit, boom, they're getting it now. And it was so loud that people started thinking, what was, what's going on around here? Well, every nation, it says, under heavens were in this area at that time, which means there was a lot of different languages that would be spoken. Well, as the disciples had the Holy Spirit in them, they started speaking in the language specific to the person that was listening to them. How cool is that? Whatever language you spoke, you were hearing the message of Jesus spoken to you in your actual language. I mean, only God, right? I mean, only God can do a miracle like that. And it says that there were over 3,000 people added to Christianity that day. That means they heard the message of Jesus in their language and 3,000 people became Christians. Boom, they believed in Jesus just like that. I mean, it goes on to tell us that Peter was just preaching and teaching, but the last verse, the one I love so much, is verse 21. So this is Acts chapter two, verse 21. It says this, and everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. You know, you might think, is it, but just those 3,000 were saved in the book of Acts? No, no, no. It, on this page, it says 3,000. I turned to the next page and I found where it says 5,000 were added. Um, I turned to another page, it says there were many more added to their number. I took large crowds were hearing the story. I mean, you look all throughout Acts and you just find that more and more Christians just were popping up. People, regular people like you and me, Cowboys, non-cowboys, they were all believing in Jesus who died on a cross and came back to life 
the real life Jesus, God's son, the Messiah, the Savior. He was alive and they were believing in him and they were becoming Christians just like that. Now, this is the first time the disciples received the Holy Spirit and then they had the Holy Spirit forever. But it's not like, oh no, just those 3,000 got it. Nope. Anybody that believes in Jesus, you, me, anybody we tell about this, mom, dad, everyone, if you believe in Jesus, you will be saved and the Holy Spirit will come and live inside of you. That's what's most exciting about this is the Holy Spirit is for everyone, no matter who you are or where you live. The story of Jesus, it's for everyone. That's why it's so important to go out and tell everybody to, to act so they can see Jesus in us. Even though our actions of doing good works, they don't make us a Christian, but we can go out and the way we act, people see us. They're like, ooh, they're a Christian. Interesting, you know? Or maybe it's something we say. It's a story we tell. Or it's kindness that we show to someone. All these things are a way we can show that we're a Christian. But truly what it is, is when they hear the message of Jesus, maybe you need to tell them, or maybe you need to send them this video or invite them to church. You can come here to Westridge Church or you can go to a church that's close by you wherever you live in this world. The message of Jesus is the same. Believe in him and you'll be saved. Man, the Holy Spirit will come into you. What a message to share with this world. Remember Jesus told us, wherever you go, tell people about Jesus. Wherever. That might be your school, that might be your house, might be your neighborhood, might be a restaurant, might be a theme park, wherever you're at. Share and show the love of Jesus because the Holy Spirit is for everyone. And when you believe in Jesus, the Holy Spirit takes up residence in you. Your body becomes his house, right? He's going to help guide you, make good decisions. He's going to help you along. He's going to listen to you when you talk to him. He can hear our prayers even when we're just thinking them. How cool is that? Only God, right? I love it. Now, i got to get back on the uh, open range here because I was... Time to be a cowboy and you guys need to learn <clears throat> what it's like to be a cowboy and how to be a cowboy. Can cowboys believe in Jesus and have the Holy Spirit live in them? You bet your bottom dollar they can, right? Everyone can receive the Holy Spirit because Jesus is for everyone. He died for the whole world. And it says if you believe in him, you'll be saved. Now let me pray for us and I'm going to get back out there and join the crew. So, uh, Close your eyes, take your cowboy hats off, cross them right here. That's what we do if you have a cowboy or cowgirl hat, you know. Let's pray. Jesus, thank you for this day. Thank you for this message of hope, knowing that if we believe in you, Jesus, we will be saved. Thank you that the Holy Spirit, God, your spirit is for everyone that believes in your son, Jesus. If there's anybody watching right now that doesn't know you as their personal Lord and Savior, I pray right now they just say, Jesus, I believe in you. I believe you're God's son. You died on the cross and you came back to life. I want to be saved. And at this moment, the Holy Spirit will come and live inside you and guide you and help you. And your journey as a follower of Jesus has begun. Jesus, for those that have already made that decision, we are going to live on this earth like it makes a difference. Because it does. We want to tell people about you. That's our job is to spread the word of Jesus everywhere we go. And one day we're going to be in heaven with you forever, where there's no more pain and no more sadness, no more tears. But while we're here on this earth, we will go and show people who you are. And in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right. Well, I'll jump back up with them boys out there. Got my shirt on. Ready? Look good? Anything? Oh, I have some right here. I better. All right. I'll see you on the range. Look your legs. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Woody fell off. Woody fell off a bullseye. Oh no. Well, are you okay? Man, that hurt. You went off the back. Uh, one good rule about being a cowboy a cowboy always carries a pack of hot sauce in his pocket. You never know when you're gonna need hot sauce, so, you know. How was it? Life changing? It's just what I like, you know, my...
Another key for being a cowboy, always close the gate after you. You don't want to leave the gate open, then then, then they all Wait, get out. So you just the, never leave the gate open. Are the okay? wiener dogs supposed to be out here? Oh, he's looking at you doing it with his dick. He, he thinks it's funny when you do that. He said, do more, please. No, that's not a bad one. Oh, where is he gonna go? Oh. Oh. Where is he going? Michael, you go in there and grab it. Hey, and we'll no all record way I'm it. going in there. I'll record it while hey. you grab it. I look like a cartoon oh, character. Right. I ain't doing that. He's gonna, he's gonna smell me. I, I'm the, I am the smallest meal you could have. So don't Hayden, go for me. Hayden has chicken juice on no! him. It is come coming, towards he's Hayden. He's coming back. He's coming he's back. Back. You guys yeah, stay in there, just so we can, no age. Just so we can see what happens. Stop! Don't do this. It's not funny. Oh my God, he's coming. Red, I'm telling you. you what know? happened? Jesus is watching you. <laughs> Open this up. I'm serious. Red, he's happen. moving. He's Open up. Open this up. <laughs> Open look this up. Look look up. Look Seriously, look Red, I'm not playing with you. He's looking at me. Come on, man. You're not. Oh, it's when you open that up. It's stuck. Open it up. It's stuck. No, no, it's unlocked. 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 Roger, it's unlocked. open that up. <laughs> I spy something green. Green. I spy. Nice, 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 nice. I, uh, I spy something very green. A tree. Yep. Good job. Good. Job. I spy something light green. A tree. Good job. Man, what's good at this? I oh, I spy something brown. That poop in my mouth you guys made me eat. Sorry. What? I can't believe you just said poop. Accident. You got milk. Nice fresh milk. Mmm. 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 <laughs> guys, 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 guys. You don't see this often. Have you heard of cocoa puffs in the oh, in the grocery store? I love yes. that cereal. Right? Yeah, they love come it. in a box. Well, they first come from a farmland. You'll notice there's cocoa puffs here on the ground. Ooh. I saw a rabbit here earlier. That means the rabbit probably likes cocoa puffs. This is there, that this is, is amazing. This yeah, is dog yeah. food. No, wait, hold, wait, wait, what? Dog food. Oh, eat it. <laughs> it's not dog food. It is rabbit. It is. <laughs> Rabbit! He put rabbit poop in his yeah. mouth! Are you serious? Yes. I have rabbit that knows. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. We might have to put down Michael. <laughs> it looks like Michael has rabies now. Michael. We're gonna be shooting him. So that's how you get rabies from rabbit. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. cocoa puffs. Oh, you're making this guy upset. <laughs> whoa, whoa, hey, hey. Said, it's his cocoa <laughs> puffs. He's saying you goofball. You <laughs> ate all my cocoa puffs. You silly. Look, see. See how I can approach wild animals like this? Absolutely. I can pet them, I can touch them, I can ride them like a horse. I can ride them like a Yeah. Like a... I'll ride that, you later. That is cool today. I'll find another horse. Well there you have it. That is basically how to be a cowboy. You Pretty know? simple life. Easy. I mean, from Bible stories on this video to, to being a cowboy, it's everything you really need to know. So feel free to pass this video on to somebody else that needs to see it. We love that you guys are with us. Give the video a like and uh, you know, subscribe if you haven't already. Hey, we love you all. This is a great time to go to westridge.com forward slash kids. Do a small group discussion together as a family. There's some fun questions on there and activities to do. That's right. <coughs> is this hay? Yeah. <coughs> hey, right, well, hey. Uh, you know, well, allergic to hay? There's a little bit of sw throat swelling up. We, hey. we love you. We'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>